Welcome or welcome back to Barrio Tales. Today's video will be about internal beef among the Fresno Bulldogs gang. Fresno Bulldogs are the top gang in Fresno, California. There's no specific leader or hierarchy, even though the Fresno Bulldogs have rivals that include Serenos, Norteños, and Crips. Just like any gang, Fresno Bulldogs are not immune to internal beef within their own gang. July 23rd, 2019. Michael Salcedo is already at the time a dropout and in bad standing with the Bulldogs. Salcedo and his friend, David Phillips, encountered two other individuals behind a gas station, resulting in one of them shooting and killing Salcedo. Based on their investigation utilizing security footage from the inside of the gas station shortly before the shooting, police eventually determined the two other individuals were Juan Carlos Miranda and Gilbert Lopez. According to the security footage, later corroborated by Facebook posts, at the time of the shooting, Juan was wearing a light gray colored shirt and Lopez was wearing a black shirt and a baseball cap. A eyewitness to the shooting was Salcedo's friend and was giving him a ride in her Tahoe to the area near the gas station. At one point before reaching their destination, she stopped the vehicle. Two individuals she did not know later identified as Juan and Gilbert and one of them said, What's up dog? to Salcedo. Salcedo responded by saying, what's up? At the time, the eyewitness did not think much of it. They drove down the road and Salcedo saw Phillips and got out to speak to him. The eyewitness made a U-turn to leave the area and saw the same two individuals from earlier, Juan and Gilbert, right in front of her vehicle. Salcedo and Phillips appeared to be arguing with Juan and Gilbert and all four individuals appeared to be getting ready for a fight. Salcedo's friend and eyewitness believed either Salcedo or Phillips may have taken a swing. At one point, the person who said, What's up, dog? Earlier, the younger of the other two pulled out a gun, which she believed to be a revolver, and shot Salcedo five times. She did not see anyone else with a weapon. She noted Salcedo did not have a shirt on and did not have any weapons on him. Salcedo was running away at the time he was shot, and multiple shots hit Salcedo's back. After the shooter fired the shots, he and the other person ran into an empty field. Immediately after the shooting, the eyewitness who gave Salcedo a ride to the gas station went inside the gas station and had the clerk call 911, and thereafter the police arrived. The body camera footage from after the shooting was admitted, showing that at the scene, the eyewitness identified the shooter as wearing a gray or beige shirt, and the other individual was wearing a baseball cap. Later, she was shown a photographic lineup and pointed to Juan Carlos Miranda's photo. She said, yeah, this guy right here. She stated she knew he was wearing a gray shirt, and she saw him pull the gun out of his waistband. She said Gilbert Lopez's black and white hat looked familiar, but pointed at Juan and stated, I know it was this guy that did it with the gray. This is the shooter. Another witness nearby exiting the parking lot of the gas station in his vehicle had heard gunshots. He heard at least five continuous shots. He could tell the shots were all in Salcedo's direction based on the injuries he later saw on Salcedo. He saw Salcedo fall to the ground where he was standing and two people take off running, then jump over a fence. Again, a third witness corroborated the eyewitness account of what she, the eyewitness, saw go down. Gilbert Lopez's ex-girlfriend told police Lopez and Miranda had left to get beer the day of the murder, and when they returned home, they said they shot a buster. Gilbert's girlfriend said that prior to the shooting, she had been hearing about Salcedo for a while, and that he rode his bike around, taunting people in the neighborhood, asking for problems. Miranda and Lopez were both Bulldog gang members, and she stated that Salcedo must have been a Bulldog dropout. It is unclear what happened to Gilbert Lopez, if he was ever charged or convicted, sent to prison, but it is unlikely as no match comes up in CDC database. That means he either is still fighting this case or got acquitted. However, Fresno Bulldog Juan Carlos Miranda was convicted of the second degree murder of Michael Salcedo. Juan Carlos Miranda received a prison sentence of 40 years to life.